when we thought of uh, how this theme might work, we wanted it to uh, be a big tent because our association includes people from many divisions who use different methods and theoretical orientations. And we wanted people to be able to find themselves in the theme. Our goal was to find a topic that was universal, that people could understand, um, not only in an academic sense, but also, I don't want to say visceral, but it was certainly, I mean, in a moral sense. People understand issues of justice, and they certainly see injustice. So this was a very compelling topic for us. When we selected the theme, we were interested in um, an opportunity for our members who are very diverse, coming across different disciplines and special interest groups, using different theories and methodologies. We were interested in a topic that would allow them to see themselves in the theme. We are a global um, organization. We have got people coming from all parts of the world in a very elementary way. When we think of praxis, we think of theory and praxis. Uh, an opportunity to not just think about uh, the research issues from a theoretical standpoint, but to actually locate that work in practical terms in what we do and in the outcomes of our research. So it was important for us to talk about uh, a theme in terms of the context of what we do to um, move our society towards equity and justice. We also have in our understanding of this theme research, theory, policy making, and praxis. So we see policy makers, decision makers in this picture and that research and praxis practice would also inform the work of policy makers uh, the work of funders and how research questions are framed so that this cycle or this uh, feedback goes not only uh, to researchers but to uh, those beneficiaries that we hope will also be able to give us feedback as researchers about how well we're doing. So there's a dynamism uh, that we're trying to reach by using the term praxis. Democratized knowledge is a, an ideal, a goal, that um, as researchers we see ourselves linked to broader communities, that we're not just talking among ourselves, and that we have avenues and opportunities for the beneficiaries of our work to join with us in evaluating how well we're doing, are we meeting the mark. Uh, we've done that in some respects at our annual meetings by engaging teachers, uh, having relationships with local communities. It goes back to we're not alone in this, right? There are other people in other places that are doing this kind of research. And by the way, I will use the term research. I think some there may have been a misconception that if you talk about justice, that's not research. Well, in fact, it is research. It's very serious research, and it's going on locally, nationally, and globally. So this is something that I think we're very interested in, we're committed to, as far as pushing our envelopes, understanding justice, right, as a research enterprise that we need to explore.